It happened because there was a, a lady who was very, a librarian, who was very, very keen to get someone involved with going around to kindergartens and day, daycare centres who could ex give children experience of, of rhymes and rhythms and poems and things that perhaps they weren't getting at home. She felt very strongly that the nursery rhymes weren't being told to children and she really felt as though they were lacking that very basic uh, learning and fun and enjoyment and so she asked me if I would like to create a program and so I did. I created a program and uh, it was to go to, to various kindergartens and I, I created an interactive situation where children could come and choose which program they'd like and then we'd have poems to that and it was I tried to make it as interactive and as as, as active as possible too within that time frame <clears throat> and some of the poems I chose I was really happy with but others I thought mm, I'd like to just do something of my own so I wrote a poem called I'm a Dirty Dinosaur the reason I wrote that was because I thought what are kids like and that was my first question what do kids like and I knew enough to know that they like dinosaurs and I knew that getting muddy and getting dirty was always great fun so that was that was when I put those two together and for some reason or other there was a little bit of magic kicked in and I started to write the rhyme and that was what I said to the children and um, then that so that was that was the main motivating thing and that went really well when I was at, uh, at the kindergartens and it struck with me it stuck with me it struck a chord with me so it, and it stuck with me and I thought whenever anything sticks with you it's because it's obviously got something that appeals and so that was that was the that was the trigger that was the you know the point of where I where it all began.